Hi, this is Dr. Barreto from Regenomics, uh, where our goal is to help you heal without drugs or surgeries. We do different orthobiologic treatments. Today, I want to walk you through the process of the PRGF for plasma enriching growth factors. And the patient today is myself. I'm injecting both of my knees. So the first step in this process is uh, we take the blood from the vein. We take about 40 ml of blood. So after the, the blood is taken out, we take it here to the lab and we put it on this centrifuge machine. Here, this is where the magic happens. We're spinning it and we are separating the, the red blood cells and white blood cells from the platelets. And this process uh, takes about eight minutes. So after the eight minutes of the centrifugation, then we take the blood out and we take the two portions of, of the uh, tubes that have the, the platelets. One is, has a, the platelet-rich plasma, or the PRP, and one has a, what is called PPP, or, or uh, uh, platelet-poor plasma. After that process, then we activate the uh, PRP and the PPP portion of the blood. So most people are familiar with what is called PRP, or platelet-rich plasma. In our case, we take it a step further and we activate the platelets. Uh, so that's what we call it PRGF, it's plasma rich in growth factors. The, pl the platelets have uh, growth factors and whenever you have an injury in your body, the platelets will go there to try to, to fix the problem. In our case, we're taking the blood from your vein, we're concentrating the platelets and we're activating those platelets. So what, what we're injecting is a PRGF and a PRGF has both an immediate effect and a longer lasting effect. So as I'm injecting my knees, uh, that's gonna form a fibrin or, 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 or a film, a fibrin film, and that's gonna start releasing growth factors for up to 10 to 14 days. So I'm using the ultrasound to make sure that I put the, the, the medicine where it needs to go. In this case, um, as you can see, uh, the needle is growing right into the joint to make sure that the PRGF is going where it needs to go. In my case, um, I was, my left knee has been hurting for the past couple of months. I had no injury, but it's been hurting every time I run. On the, in the case of the right knee, uh, a couple of days ago, I was at the gym and, and had a awkward fall on, on the right leg. So, um, but this, this uh, treatment can be used to treat any sports injury. It can be used for spine, hip, joints, and even nerves. Um, what I'm gonna do is over the next couple of days, I'm gonna rest uh, I'm not going to do any exercise. I may have some soreness, which is part of the process. And, but if I have pain, I will take Tylenol or I'll put some ice. Or, uh, but the main thing is to avoid any anti-inflammatories because that will be fighting what we're trying to accomplish, which is healing. When you, when you take anti-inflammatory, you bring the inflammation down, but you're, you're slowing down healing. And after a couple of days, then my plan is to slowly start my activity again and, and start exercising. Some, some cases will just need one treatment, but oftentimes if the condition is more moderate, uh, you may need uh, three treatment sessions. So that's it for the PRGF. It was a great patient that we had today in, in our clinic. Uh, so if you want more information, if you think that PRGF can help you heal without drugs or surgeries, then visit our website and you can call us too.